Hello, my name is Janelle. I'm one of the registered nurses here at Life Navigators. Over the past few months, due to the coronavirus pandemic, we have been taught many ways how to keep yourself safe out in the community. One of the most important ways that you can keep yourself safe is to wear a face covering. Today, I'm going to demonstrate for you how to apply and remove a face mask. First of all, you will need three things. You will need a paper bag, your hand sanitizer or a hand washing station, and of course, your mask. Prior to applying a mask, you want to complete hand hygiene. You may either wash your hands with warm soap and water or apply hand sanitizer. I'm going to use my hand sanitizer. After your hands are clean and fully dry, you want to take your mask by the ear loops. Now the outside of the mask is the dirty or the outside part of the mask. You want to refrain from touching this area. Simply apply the mask with the ear loops. Now you can use the ear loops to adjust around the chin. As you can see, my nose and my mouth are covered. You may pinch the top of the mask over the bridge of your nose to secure. Now that you're wearing your mask, again, refrain from touching the outside of the mask or your face, as this is how viruses and bacteria can be transmitted. Even though you're wearing a mask, you still need to practice your social distancing. That includes staying at least six feet away from others and avoiding large crowds. ready to remove your mask, you want to complete hand hygiene again. Either wash your hands or hand sanitizer. I'm going to use my hand sanitizer. When your hands are dry, you're ready to remove your mask. Again, do not touch the outside or the dirty part of your mask. Grab your mask by the ear loops and simply remove. Do not touch the outside of the mask. You will want to fold the mask by touching it on the outside and folding it in. Now that the mask is folded with the dirty part on the inside, you want to take your plastic bag and insert your mask. Once the mask is in there, you want to fold your bag and take it to where you can wash it. When you wash your mask, you want to make sure you wash it in hot water and dry it with high heat. Also make sure that your mask is fully dry before wearing again. Some masks do not have ear loops. Some masks have ties. Again, to apply this type of mask, complete your hand hygiene. You want to take the mask by the ties. You apply the mask over your nose and your mouth and secure the mask by tying. You will then grab the ties on the bottom and secure again. You can also adjust the mask around your chin by using the ties. Again, please refrain from touching the outside or the dirty part of the mask. Once you're ready to take your mask off again, complete your hand hygiene and you want to untie the ties. Once it is removed, again, do not touch the outside of the mask. You want to fold the dirty part on the inside. And again, put it in your paper bag to take it home for washing. It is not a good idea to store your dirty masks in a backpack or a purse, as that also can be a source of transmission for diseases. Some people have a surgical mask. Now the surgical mask is to be worn only one time. It is not recommended to be worn more than once. Again, you want to complete your hand hygiene, grab it by the ear loops, apply and you can adjust with the ear loops and again, secure the mask by pinching the mask on the bridge of your nose. Again, removing hand hygiene with the ear loops, folding the dirty side in 
without touching the outside and disposing of your mask. These are some ways that you can keep yourself safe out in the public. Remember, you're not only protecting yourself, you're protecting others too. Thank you and have a great day.